what's up guys, DLMP here today, welcome back to a brand new video of The Sims 4. Today I am doing my very first shell challenge. Uh, this is the April 2021 shell challenge and I am very excited for this. I've been wanting to do this for a little while but it's finally here. Um, you can download the shell, it's on the gallery, my gallery name is Olympi. simple as that, just like my username, but without the games, YouTube username, but without the games. So I built this structure, and um, the initial plan, uh, well the plan was to make it into a container home. Now you guys are free to do whatever you want with it, but that's what I've done with it. Uh, for those of you who don't know what a shell challenge is, basically it's a challenge where somebody builds a shell of a house and then the uh, someone else needs to fill that shell with furniture and stuff. But there is one very important rule. Don't touch my walls. Now I've built the walls hill here. And you cannot touch them. You are not allowed to touch them. You can move the building on the lot as a whole, but you cannot touch the walls. You can add windows and doors, but don't touch my walls. Now that's a very important room, because if you touch my walls, then instead of being the beautiful shell challenge, it becomes, oh hey, this random guy just placed some walls on this um, on this lot, but you know what, just do whatever with them, if you want to, you can delete them. That is not the point of this challenge. The point is, I give you guys a challenge, you need to build something creative. And I also need to build something creative. But don't forget, don't touch my walls. Okay, anyway, so I was building this container home in Evergreen Harbor, you know, as you do. Um, also, by the way, uh, two hours ago, well, two hours before when this video was uploaded, I, um, I was streaming on Twitch, twitch.tv slash daylimpy, by the way, I was streaming Transport Fever. Now, um, my buddy Tristan, who has featured on the, um, Blindfold Build Challenge, has been asking me for quite some time to make YouTube videos about transport fever. Now, I would love to do that, but I'm going to explain you guys your, my situation to you guys. Um, I'm 14 year old kid. I live in country bleep, and um, <laughs> in Europe, and I am a high school student. Well, homeschooled high school student, but I still still have to study a lot, which means that I don't have as much time as people would think. Now I already have to record, edit, and upload at least eleven videos a week, which is already quite a lot. I feel like eleven videos a week, but. If I started another channel where I would do things like Transport Fever, City Skylines, Prison Architect and Planet Zoo, then I, I'd feel myself obliged to make at least another four videos a week on that channel. Because otherwise I wouldn't, I, I don't feel like it's a channel if you don't have at least three or four videos. Well, like, I guess I could make it a two videos a week channel. Huh, I, l I hadn't thought of that. You guys, you guys are good listeners. Yeah. You know what? I'll look into it. I'll, I'll try. I'll, actually? Yeah, but also, like, next year I'm hoping I can go to university and then, mm, it's, it's complicated. Anyway, back to the bills. Uh, so this is a eco lifestyle and base game only house. But as you saw right there, you can go and be like, but 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 they but you use the tiny living bed and the tiny living thingy ma bob. Yeah, I know that was stupid, Olympi. Uh, yeah, he features in most of my videos. I completely forgot, but later when I was just uh, building one of the other bedrooms, I realized. Oh, yeah, wait a second. 
I did that, right, okay. Anyway, um, so like, um, my idea was, so you got these, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six containers. Mm, wait, one, two, three, yeah, four on the ground floor and two on the upstairs. My initial idea was that we get the, um, pink container. The, the, the one that is separate from all the other ones, that's grandma's room. Grandma lives with grandma or grandpa, I'm not sure. Depends on who you want to. Lives with them and uh, they sleep in that container, the pink one. But then we've got, um, a li we've got everything you need basically. Like there's two bathrooms, there's a living room, a kitchen, a dining room. Three bedrooms. You can sleep. You can live slim six sims here comfortably. Sorry, just had a sip of water. Mm. So yeah. Uh yeah, it's it's been a long day. I've been uh, streaming, transport fever, for like two hours. Also, um. Since this video, I am using Wondershare Filmora to edit my videos. So, like, uh, let me know if you notice any difference. Uh, I certainly do, because before I was using, what is it, um, Windows Video Editor. It's, um, it's like, if you've got a Windows on your computer, you open the Photos app. And the top left, you click on video editor. Yeah, that's what I used. <laughs> kind of embarrassing. But anyway, um, now I've changed to Wondershare Filmora. Awesome. Uh, I absolutely love it. I've been like, uh, it's nerd o'clock. <laughs> I've just been, oh, kind of embarrassing to say this. Uh, for the past um, hour and a half since I bought the software, I've been in Nerdhala. Like, this has just been like, oh my god, you can do that with an editing tool? Like, huh? Like, some of these things, like, th how it's just so easy to just fast forward this and then add in an, uh, an uh, audio overlay. Like, I used to work with Audacity whenever I wanted to record an uh, audio clip. And now it's so smooth, it's so... Oh, also, there was this problem on the other one, which meant that I couldn't actually cut or split anything. There was this glitch where if you tried to cut, then you'd get some clips, some parts of the clip that played doubled, and other parts of the clip that only played a part of it. And I don't have that now! It's awesome. Okay, but like... Housewise, so there's um, place for six sim space for six sims to dine inside, and eight to dine outside. So right now we've just finished the first floor. Then we're gonna do the second floor in any second, like any second. Yeah, ladder. We use the ladder in the income hall in the welcome hall. So here we get a little living room. If I'm gonna start building, yes. Past Olympi, yeah. Start building, please, yeah. So uh, we're getting in this living room. We, um, I like this house. Yeah, because it's you've got everything you need. Like, yet when you look from the outside, like when I first saw the shell, I was like, oh my god, what did I do? And I'm like, oh, I'm chi. This is awesome. Uh, but yeah, I use it. This is purely eco lifestyle and base game. Like, there is nothing else. So, like, yeah, it's. Yeah, also, here I was fiddling around. I also, by the way, want to say, I built this whilst watching an episode of uh, Blacklist. Uh, if you don't know, it's an amazing TV sh series, which is, uh, among others, on Netflix. Uh, and uh, it's. It's really cool. Um, in case you don't know it, uh, it's about this uh, number four most wanted guy uh, on the FBI most wanted list. Walks into an FBI bureau and signs a deal with them to 
as he says, take down his blacklist, but really just in make in, in begin his own crime emporium by taking out his enemies through the FBI. So like it's it's really like a sneaky bastard, you know. I I like it. It's it's fun. But anyway, um, I guess we're almost done now. Uh, also, I would like you to uh, ask you to leave a like, subscribe, comment down below, uh, especially leave uh, and tell your friends about my channel because let's say it is awesome. But uh, yeah, if you enjoyed this video, uh, oh dear, bye.